Hello everyone, so in this video let us talk about the second problem from the latest code forces round 810 problem name party. So you're given that a club plans to hold a party and they invited n members to that. Now those n members are numbered from 1 till n as you can understand and the, if the ith members is not invited that will create an unhappiness to the party of AFI. So you can at least see the input that you are given that let's say this there are three people in the party and if the ith person is not invited it will cause the unhappiness of this so let's say the first person is not invited so it will cause an unhappiness of two second person is not invited so unhappiness of one and so on okay now there are m pair of friends also among these n friends so you have these n, n people and among these n people there are m friends fine as per tradition if both the people from a friend pair are invited so if both the friend pair are invited they will share a cake at the party that is fine the total number of cakes eaten will be equal to the number of pair of friends such that both of the members are invited so the total number of cakes that are eaten is equivalent to the pair of friends that are there at the party now the club oven has the capability to cook two cakes at a time and thus because they cook two cakes at a time eventually they can only produce even number of cakes like whatever number of iteration they do let's say that in the first bake they've like they will bake two cakes and two cakes or two cakes so it will always be an, uh, like always be an even number so they don't want to waste cakes out so they just want that how many because the pair can only eat cakes okay and so that they just want that even number of pairs should be there in the party such that even cakes will form and they will form even number of cakes so that there's no wastage so how it is possible to minimize the unhappiness of the party Okay, because if some people are not invited, so if the number of, uh, let's say, pairs are odd, so odd cake will form, but you don't want that. So you have to remove some per person out. And if you want to remove, the unhappiness will increase because some people are not invited. And thus, you have to minimize the total number of unhappiness in the party. That's the overall objective for you. How you can do that? If the total number of pairs are even, that's the first case, then it is better to invite everyone out because everyone is there in the party. So unhappiness is zero and everyone is inv invited the even number of cakes can be formed with the even number of pair friends that are there if the number of pairs are odd then what will happen let's talk about that so let's move this out so the number of pairs are odd let's take an example of i'll just draw a graph out of things so let's take this is this person this person is invited to this person so we have different numbers you can assume so this one so there are three edges which means like uh, these three are different pairs and they are odd okay now if you what you can understand is if they're odd i have to remove some person out now or let's say let's make this more interesting so one two three four five six and seven now there are seven connections you can see so seven uh, pairs are there so let's say one so whatever as you can see this is one of the peer connection so these are friends now what you can see is that i have to somehow break out like i should not be bringing out one of the person if i just break out one of the person then this this person will like this friendship will not be there this bond will not be there and there are six bonds out of there so the best way possible is to remove a person now if i remove a person what will happen is ki the bonds which are connected to that person will always be removed and thus if the person is connected to let's say odd number of people then all the odd connections will be disconnected so let's say that this person is connected let's say like this so if this person is disconnected there are three person that are connected to it all the person will be disconnected because if this this person will not come to the party then this friendship will not form this friendship will not form this friendship will not form and thus only these two friendship will come form and these are even so what it actually means is if i somehow delete a friend that is having odd number of connections then that friend will not come and odd number of friendship will break or like odd number of friendship will not come and thus odd number of so if we have odd odd friends like odd number of connections if you delete odd then odd minus odd equal become equal so even number of friend connection will be there and that is fine for us so what the main task is that i should find out among all the people who has odd connections and if i want to remove out some of the person i should remove the person that has the minimum happiness i hope you get the one because if i i only have to remove one person 
because if I remove that, I don't have to remove other person because other person do come to the party, but they do not contribute to the cake part. The cake part only contribute from peers. Okay, so this is even like these parts are like leave around. We don't have to care about the single persons. Only peers we have to talk about. Okay, so if I remove a person, so I can invite this person of the in the party also. No problem because this will not contribute to any cake problem. The cake problem will all, only come from the person that are in pairs. And if I remove a person, these pairs will disturb, like get disturbed, and thus only even pairs will remove, like uh, remain, and thus uh, it will get fine to us. But like, is this the only answer that can you think of? No, that's not. Why? Let's talk about that al also. Okay, just move out this part. Now, what you can also think of is that if I remove one person out, then that is fine. Like it will remove out some parts. But the other case can also be that if I am remo removing one person that will cause me this removing in like odd numbers, why not just remove one pair? Because see, I have even pairs, one pair, two pairs. So I have even number of members, now, like M is equal to number of pairs that are coming to the party are even. Or oh, sorry, odd, not sorry, yeah, not odd. Uh, it is odd because we are assuming that they are odd. Okay, because I want to form even number of pairs. So odd people are coming. So if I just remove one, even like one pair from that, the number of pairs will remove will be even. And that's the only thing that we also want. So if I just remove a pair from that, whatever pairs we have, so I should be removing the pair that is having the minimum value. Like if I remove that pair out, the minimum number of happiness should be removed. So two cases are there, either remove a person or remove a pair whatever you want and whatever gives a minimum among all of them that's the over answer so let's talk about the code part now so what we have done is that we have taken an an m the answer is any slice to very large value because you have to minimize the total answer then we will iterate over and just store out u and v what are the pairs because it is one indexing subtract one from it in both the values because we have to do it in zero indexing and it will become easy to us and we are pushing back that for any i, what all friends are there and for any like we are just making a map some sort of thing so that in the end we know for every person how many friends are attached to it because in, we have to all know that a person how many edges are there so that we know that it has even edges or odd edges because we can only delete out a person that has odd edges. So the only thing is that if it is even if the number of friendships that we have are even then we don't have to think about anyone just bring every person out in the fan like in the party and the total unhappiness is zero but if it is odd then what we'll do is we have two cases the first case is that we'll have to pick out a pair that we have done here okay we have to minimize over all the pairs so you and we just take out every pair that we have by by pair i means that whatever pairs are given in the problem that is you and we just take out the unhappiness value and just add them out and we have to minimize that the other case also can be that if a person that we're removing has like should be having odd number of connections so the number of connections for any ith person is this because we are storing that connections here so for any person if it is having odd number of connections then we have to remove that person from the party so if removing that person will bring out unhappiness of afi by removing that person and we have to minimize among all of all of these conditions and that's answer it's just a greedy problem you have to think over all the various conditions and then it will become very intuitive to you that's the overall logic and code part for this problem Thank you for watching this video till the end. I will see you in the next one. Like coding and bye.